What is going on everybody? It's uh, Mr. Big Z. Um, I'm back with a, another drift build. Uh, we're going to do the same type of thing we did last time. Just going to choose a random car. Let's get into it. Just got to wait for the loading here. Alright, let's teleport. Um, where is it? I'm so lost. Guys thinking I'm a noob. Let me know in the comments what your what your favorite car is. That's what I want to know. Like I want to see um, what the most popular result is. Um, it can be any car. It could be Bugatti, whatever. Depends on if you're crazy or not, I guess. Um, mine is obviously a 98 Toyota Supra, left-hand drive, six-speed target top, to be exact. Oh, turbo also. Alright, I'm just gonna go like this. Um, actually, you know what? You guys are just going to have to take my word for it. I'm going to close my eyes and just go back and forth. I'm gonna just, my eyes are closed right now. Let's just mix it up a little bit here. Whatever car I choose is going to be our drift car. Okay, and one more time. And stop. Uh -huh. I'm gonna make I'm gonna I'm gonna make it a drift car I guess. <laughs> it's gonna be interesting. Oh You know what? I'll buy it for you guys. No excuses. There we go. Sorry about that. I had to cut that out. I don't want you guys seeing my information. That would be bad. Well, you know, most of you I probably trust, but you know, there's those guys out there that's just. I don't know why. Oh, this would be a rare car in Canada. I'm from Canada, by the way. A little right hand drive CRX. I think we have one right hand drive 97 Civic. Or maybe it's a 94. I'm not sure. But yeah, it's, it's that type of Civic, and it's right-hand drive, and it's real rare. Okay, this is going to be fun. I'm going to have to um, convert it to rear-wheel drive. Honda guys are going to hate me, but it's a drift build, so... VTEC. Hey Alright, let's What's just that? turn this thing up. We're going to leave stock engine again. We're going to try it. Let's turbo it. Love turbos. Turbos and supers. That's me. Okay, rear wheel drive. What kind of nasty bumpers do they got? Oh my god. Let's go stock. Okay, let's get some horsepower going first. And then we'll look at the other things. Now this thing is kind of light, so, well, it's very light. So I don't need lots of horsepower, but. Last car, uh, the uh, Porsche um, we built, or I built, I don't know. I find that YouTubers always say we, but it's always just the YouTuber. We, you guys didn't help me build it. I'm sorry, it's just, I, it's a thing I noticed. Okay, but the the Porsche I built last episode, it was it was a great drift car, um, but it could use a tiny bit more power. So I'm hoping maybe for 
600 in this one. Let's see what we can get. Let's just max it out. Looks like we're only going to get like 530, 512, 5, 526. Uh, nope. 516. Okay, that, I guess that's going to have to do because I'm leaving the stock engine. That's quite a bit actually. Slam it. Oh, that's going to be a lot, actually. It's a lot of horsepower for... It's about 2,000 pounds after I take this out. Bulletproof the tranny. I'm doing the Storm Island one again. I'm just maxing this thing out. I'm gonna go with sport. Like I said last time, uh, my builds, they're basically the same for every car. There's a little bit of a difference, but Where are those rims? I think there's these ones. Yeah, this is more of a drag civ it looks like. I had a hard time deciding there. I don't know. Some of you are probably like getting real mad at me. Why are you making those rims big? That looks good. Looks nice. Can we get a little... Oh, no. No, we'll go with that. It's whatever. Okay, there ain't no good bumpers for Civics. Okay, let's test it out. Let's see what this thing can do. Oh, of course, it's raining every time. Very weird driving a Civic that's rear wheel drive. But this is definitely our, can, I can already tell this is going to be a fun little drift car. Okay, let's bring this. That. Okay, ride height. There we go. There we go. Okay, that should be good. But it is raining. I guess we're just going to have to deal with it. Awesome little car. It's real light. Kitten V Tech. Let's see, where does V Tech kick in? About five. If you guys are looking for a like a huge VTEC kick sound, go with the S2000. Just cracks so hard. Oh, I wasn't watching the screen for a second. I I watched it again. It's really hard to to make a drift car in the rain. But yes, it's very good. I can already tell. Oh. 
play. We need some corners here. Well, actually, it needs to stop raining, but like that's gonna happen. Maybe if I TP real quick, maybe I'll let's go over here. Loading, loading. There we go. Uh, no, I didn't bring anything. But whatever. Okay, let's see on the long corner here. Let's see what this thing can do. Not shortcut here. Oh, never mind. It's a wall. What's over the horizon? A damn wall. Okay. It's starting to. The sun's coming out, so that's a good sign. Okay, there's one little tweak I gotta do. Bring fifth gear a little bit closer. That's good. Let's try that. Yes. That's what I'm talking about. Some people uh, make their drift turns for like second and third gear, third and fourth. Um, I used to do that, and then I decided um, to go higher gears. I don't know why. I guess to keep this sh uh, the the short gears for. Real like hairpins. Okay, let's see here. Oh yes, get it, homie. Oh, that angle. Keep it going. Ah, darn it. I, I lost it. Chain it, chain. Okay, yeah, now that it's not raining, the tune feels totally different. I like this little circuit here. I bring most of my drift cars here. Okay, um, I'm having a little bit of a difficulty here. We'll fix it right up. Let's crank this. There, that should be better. Oh, I was not ready for that. Okay, now that it's dry, let's try this corner again. Do one more circuit. Goodness. There's too much traffic usually here. Yes. Oh my gosh. Steady 9,000 RPM. I like it. Stupid Trino. Can we go on the grass? Still got it though. Wow, that was a poor 360 entry. Let's try a reverse entry with this. Way too early. Way too late. Oh, maybe not. Yeah, this car doesn't have enough torque, this engine. 
this were to have a V8, reverse entries would be no problem. Okay, one more time around this corner. This is a lot of fun. Uh, it seems like there's no traffic and then at the corner, there's, there's always cars. There we go. Lots of angle. Just full throttle. Oh, yes. Keep it going. Oh, my gosh. Okay, let's try this reverse entry one more time. Right now. Yeah, like, it stalled out on me. I'll, I'll rewind. Oh, it's killing me. I want to do this. Oh, I gassed it too early. Oh, damn it. There we go. That is what's up. Well, there you have it, boys and girls. That's how you make a CRX drift. Um, uh, I'd like to thank you guys for watching. Uh, go ahead and make this car. It's actually quite fun. Way better than I thought it was going to be. Uh, and uh, for now, I guess I'll, get, I'll see you guys in the next video. See ya.